case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The United States government, in the case of Estevez v. United States, appealed a New York court ruling requiring the purchase of an annuity to pay a damage award instead of providing a lump sum payment in a personal injury case. The New York law, which mandates structured payments when future damages exceed $250,000, was applied in the lower court's decision. That court also decided that taxes should not be deducted from the award for future lost earnings, and the lump sum payment for future pain and suffering was not reduced to reflect the time value of money. The government, however, disagreed with the decision, arguing that the Federal Tort Claims Act only authorizes lump sum damage awards, and the New York state law should not apply. The court ultimately held that the government was required to pay the damage award through a structured payment plan without reducing taxes, and that the time value discount was already accounted for when using an annuity. The government's objections were found to lack legal merit, and the case is ongoing as they seek reconsideration and modification of the ruling. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.